Hi, I'm Liz Segrin, and I'm a senior staff writer here at Fast Company. And I just got back from a week of vacation, and I feel so great, where we stayed in the middle of the forest, far away from other people, but it was amazing. We had s'mores by the fire, we slept in very comfortable beds, and I feel totally refreshed for the first time in six months. I did a lot of research to plan this vacation, and in Digging through lots of different websites, I found several tips that will allow us to have a fun, relaxing, but also safe vacation during this pandemic. I found an amazing startup called Getaway. We went to one in New Hampshire that was an hour away from our house here in Boston. It felt like a completely different universe. Getaway has taken these tiny houses and set them in the middle of the woods. They're Tiny, but extremely comfortable. You get a little kitchen, a shower, and a bathroom. But the best thing about it is that when you go to sleep at night, there is a full glass window that you're staring out of so that you can look right into the forest as you're going to sleep and as you wake up in the morning. The goal of these getaway cabins is really to spend as much time as you can outside. It is the perfect vacation for a pandemic because you don't have to interact with anybody else during your entire trip. You get there, they give you a code that unlocks your cabin. The cabin has been cleaned from top to bottom between guests. And you get to spend this time in the middle of the forest, far away from anybody else, but it feels wonderful. I haven't taken a flight since the beginning of this pandemic, but I have friends and family members who have had to. So if you happen to be somebody who needs to take a trip to visit a family member or for work, there are things that we can do to try and make the trips feel a little safer. One of the best ones that I've found is a company called Nice Seats that make these little pouches that contain a seat cover for your flight. It even comes with a little pouch that is attached to the seat so that you don't have to store anything in the seat in front of you. It's just a little thing that you can do to give yourself some peace of mind if you have to take a, a trip across the country. I grew up traveling a lot, and so I've had a lot of time to think about what makes the best suitcase. And by far, my favorite comes from a German company called Remoa, or if you're actually German, you would pronounce it Remova. The suitcase combines the best German engineering with uh, a love of travel. And with this latest line, there's also a pop of fun and color and fashion, and I love all of it. They come out this week, but they sent me one to take a look at. This one is beautiful and pink, and I could totally see myself using this all the time once travel resumes. I, for one, can't wait for the day when we'll be able to travel like we used to. But until that time comes, these things can hopefully help us get out of the house in a way that is relaxing, fun, and also safe.